We got one view. Nice. <laughs> you all the test, certified, get the, get the fucking license. Of course, like, like we do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, of course, do it once and like, yo, Pax pulled out a gun, murdered Troy. My first month, I made about 25K US. And that's like a trillion dollars in, ca in Canadian, you know? This ain't like gonna be some rah rah motivational boost. Like, as soon as Donald Trump became president, it's like it's no longer about who's actually the best president. It's about, like, it's all the popularity the contest. Now, we knew that, but I thought that America had some sort of, like, moral compass, and um, <laughs> and we would elect people who had, like, experience and shit, but uh, that has not been the case. Uh, but that's cool. Hey, that's, that's the game we're playing now, so fuck it, man. I'm not a big fan of Donald Trump, and you knew that because I live in New York. And I'm black, mm -hmm. right? Because I was in this New York liberal bubble, goddamn snowflake liberals, you know, mm -hmm. liberal bubble, goddamn black people on the Democratic plantation. Clearly, gonna win by landslide. Just wait, guys. First female president. It's gonna be weird. Uh, at least once a month, but it should be better than that. <laughs> we get in a fucking four-day war once a month. <laughs> However, I was blindsided and I started asking why they voted for Donald Trump, man. So the, a lot of what I got was, man, America's too PC. Somebody come in here and speak the truth. And like, it's almost like these guys wanted to vote for Rambo. I've had this theory for like a long time. It's yet to be disproven. I believe subconsciously Americans vote for the person they think will win in a fight. All right, so right now I'm about to do a bunch of interviews with like some of my like, business coaching students, the ones who had like a lot of success. It's kind of cool to see how they did and hopefully that'd be helpful for you guys. So listen, you've had a lot of success with the program. Uh, can you can you, can you you share what, what your experience was like in the program? Well, I started out from like nothing. Like nothing? You had no fan base? No, no, you, you never trained anybody online before? Yeah, I've never one-on-one -on -one trained with anyone, even in the group. And that group is um, relatively small, right? It's like 800 people or something like that. It's not. I, I just want to, like people to understand. It's not about the audience, right? It's about like still, like you can still have success, you know, with a small audience. Having your course and you having the breakdown of this and how to. That, how that was all the information that was in the like the, the trainings, yeah. yeah. Moabas, your first month, how much did you make? My first month, I made about 25. US. And that's like a trillion dollars in, ca in Canadian, no? Before I came to you, I was actually part of another coaching mastermind group. Mm -hmm. So I made a lot of good connections while I was there, but I wasn't seeing the results that I wanted. Yeah. And most of all, I was losing money. You're working with one guy, you didn't make any money, you in fact you were losing money, you ended up driving Uber, then it was you, you decided, all right, I'm gonna pick one of these two coaches. I mean I've had game plans from other coaches mm. as well that I spent money on. But again, these people don't know what to actually do because they're making their money off the coaching versus with you, you have an actual business. Working all day and night. What time is it, man? It's um it's ten, man. It's yeah. almost ten. I don't give a fuck. So what's that, like 14 hour a day? I wanna say so. I don't want balance. Perfectly balanced. This whole thing should be. No! I want extreme results. And extreme results don't come from balance. Extreme results come from extreme action. You can be balanced if you want. And that's cool. That's fine. Like if balance is more important than extreme results, then that's fine. You just have to accept that. Uh, I'm, I will not accept that. I'm out. <laughs> Capitalism.